developing news out of Chesapeake. A six month old is in critical condition after a house fire this afternoon. Crews were called to a home on Wright Avenue in the South Norfolk section of the city. Officials say five children were inside the home when the fire started. All of them are under 10 years old. Town your side's Asia Tolliver spoke with neighbors who helped rescue the kids and their parents. It was honestly a huge shock to me. I wasn't even expecting it. Ed Page says he was in the middle of playing a video game when he heard an alarming sound and grabbed his roommate to go check it out. Well, I started hearing kids screaming for help and we went outside and we noticed kids were inside a burning house. So Page and his roommate Ron Bollinger jumped into action. I noticed they were all at the window. I it happened to, the roofer left the ladder there when we had our roof done. I put it up, climbed up, and they were all trying to grab on me. So I was helping them, and then a gentleman named Sean was down below grabbing him as, he, as the one gentleman was dropping him. Bollinger says just as he was grabbing the fourth child, firefighters arrived. Then the children's mother and her boyfriend came running. They say the boyfriend's brother was supposed to be watching the kids at the time of the fire. The mom says at first she was comforted by firefighters who told her all four of her children were safe, but quickly realized they didn't get them all out. I said, tell me you got the baby out of the house. And he said, what baby? I said, there's a baby downstairs in the room, in the sleeper. Fire officials say they went inside the house to perform a search and found a six-month-old child in a downstairs bedroom. Neighbors say they ran the baby to an ambulance. Perkins says the baby is in the NICU with a breathing tube, but is expected to be okay. She says fire investigators believe it started with a pot on the stove. But despite the house being a total loss, Perkins is beyond grateful. And she had one thing to say to the brave neighbors and firefighters who saved her kids. Thank grateful. you so, 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 so much from the bottom of my heart.